Hi everyone, this is Dave with another update video for you on my jailbroken iPhone 4. Now this video will be applicable to any iOS device, so you might have an iPod Touch. Well in this one, I'm going to be showing you four different tweaks, five column springboard, five icon dock, shrink and grid lock. Now the first one you're seeing here is five column springboard. We've got five uh, columns here instead of four. For your icons and really great that you can now fit more icons into the screens of your, your iOS device. Now if I go into settings and then down to five column springboard the settings are very simple on this. There's not a lot you can change. You can either switch it on or off. If I switch it off it's going to go back to the four icon setting but with it active we've got five columns of icon showing on my device so very very cool I like this a lot now there's also the dock area down here and the way that you get your five icons in the dock is using something called five icon dock uh, again available in Cydia and this just enables you to put your five icons down in the dock area so that's really cool now you will notice that things look quite um, sort of cramped at this particular size and this is where another uh, download from Cydia comes into play and it's called shrink here you can see the settings icon for shrink and this is really cool I like this a lot now if I just do the, the very simple one which is this page icons one I can actually uh, let's do it so that you can see the difference let's do it to 80% and then we go back and you can see and now all of my icons are a lot smaller so you can see in my dock they're the original size and in this top panel they are a lot smaller 80% of the original size so that's really cool that's a very very quick setting that, that makes everything look superb so let's some um, I like it on 90% so let's do it to 90% let's do the same this time for the dock icons and then let's do the same for the switcher icons as well and then let's go back so now you can see that all of them are a lot smaller now you'll also notice these little badges here like this one for the app store is quite close to the edge of my display if you go into the settings again in shrink you can actually change the badge scale as well so if that was on a hundred percent let's change the badge scale back up to a hundred percent you will see that it's very cramped. Let's go back out. Look, these are the original size, so it's just just too big. They need to sort of match the icon scale. So you can, if I go back into settings again, change the badge scale to a percentage or to match the icon scale. So I could have they, these badges. I could have them really small. Let's set that to 66% uh, and see what that looks like. As you can see, this one here. On my app store is at 66% and this one here is at 100% so you can see the difference let me just give you a close-up on that so you can certainly see the difference between the two sizes on those badge icons so I tend to have it set to take on the same scale as I've set my icons so my icons are set to 90% and the badge scales will be the same as well so let's set them all to icon scale So they all stay the same, so everything is now on 90%. Let's go back out to my settings and then back to the uh, home screen. So now you can see that the badge icons are a lot smaller. You can obviously tweak it down to suit your preferences. And now the last one I wanted to mention to you was Gridlock. Uh, now I don't think there are any settings for Gridlock. No, I'm correct. There aren't any actual um, settings for it. But again, it's a download from Cydia and what Gridlock enables you to do is to position your icons wherever you want them now I've got a space up the top here and I've got that up there for a, a, a reason I'm going to show you that in a later video why, why I've got that space there but normally when you reposition icons on your device everything else shifts around to fill up the empty space with Gridlock you can position your icons wherever you want them so you might want to leave space here for some sort of widget and and it's much like on um, other
platform devices where you can position them wherever you want. I know Android, you can position them in any uh, position, and and this does just that. So you can leave spaces uh, wherever you want, and it's just fantastic. I really do like Gridlock. Very very simple application, but very um, effective. And as I say, as you get used to adding tweaks to your device, you'll understand why you need something like Gridlock. So I hope you found this video useful. This was using five column springboard, so that's five hyphen column springboard, five icon dock to get your five icons down here, shrink to shrink everything down, and also to shrink the badge icons as well, and grid lock to allow you some flexibility in how you position your icons. Well, thank you very much for watching. Please do come back soon, and I'll be doing another update video on some more tweaks on the iPhone 4.